How's it going, Joker family? It's your boy, Haha ha Joker, aka the Black Joker, back at it again with another Madden video for you guys. So, today, finally, the other part of the house rules is done. We got the new part of house rules now. So, it's called Rumble Overtime. Alright, switch it up. You're heading into overtime, but both teams will get a chance to drive this week. Start the house rules missions to learn, and that's where we go ahead and kick it off, man. So, the first house rules that I did, um, it was good, but I didn't get a lot of the wins that I really wanted to before this new one came out. Try grinding it, but it, it gets repetitive, it gets boring. Again, it's a lot of games. So, you know, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and look into it real quick. Try to see if there's any more information about it. Um, but yeah, man, the, these games are very they're not long but the the process to like get the games done like all 130 of them it's very time consuming so like and on top of that it's like dang like for a random redux player it's it's tough bro it really is but anyways um got some information for you guys um so why we go ahead and look through all this stuff um we we'll talk a little bit more about the um, theme teams. So, um, like I said, I'm still going to be posting out Oakland Raiders theme teams. But um, I have someone working on a 49ers theme team. So, I'm going to be rolling that out um, eventually. Um, probably sometime next week, actually. I'll probably be rolling that out. But, um, yeah, man, might as well just get the entire Bayside thing done and, you know, get Oakland done and try to see I wanted to do 49ers for a while so you know it kind of works out um and not giving me much information here so I guess I have to go into the actual the actual thing I've seen information that the games are worth double now I'm not sure if that's true or not uh switch it up how should we get more chance no nah, I'm not seeing that oh yeah I do okay so 130 total wins Win counts as two. All right, so yeah. Okay, so now if you win games, they count as two wins now. So that's very good. I guess it, I guess it gives people a chance that didn't get the first one done, like did didn't get any of the house rules from the first time done. They're giving them a chance to catch up with this one by giving it the games are worth two wins now. So that's really good. So I should be able to get through this pretty quickly. But um, but yeah, man, that's the new house rules. Um. I believe that there was some limited time players supposed to be dropping soon, which, yes, they did. All right, so Carson Wentz and Avery Williamson. So, I'm going to go ahead and look into those guys real quick. And, um, you know, while we're here, we'll go ahead and look at the heavyweights that dropped, I believe, yesterday, too. Um, where are the heavyweights? Okay. Um, I looked at the heavyweights. They... Not bad. I'll say that. We'll, we'll leave it at that. I'll say they're not bad. Um, but um, who's the first one? Geno Atkins. All right. So we got Geno Atkins here. 75 speed, 81 acceleration, 87 strength, 78 tackling, 91 play rack, 85 block shed, 89 power move, and 76 finesse. So uh, better pass rusher than Darnell Dockett. Uh, two less than Darnell Dockett on the block shed. Better play rack. Less tackling, which is kind of weird for a D tackle, but whatever. Uh, strength is minus one. Sure, if you power him up, he'll be up. Has better speed and better acceleration. Um, again, this Geno Atkins, he can hold his own, all right, and you can power him up. Um, I would I would imagine there's not too many people running like a Bengals theme team, so. Um, but he can hold his own. Good speed for a D tackle. Good acceleration. Uh, has better finesse than both my starting D tackles right now. Has better power move than both of them. Um, but yeah, man, he's not bad. He can really hold his own. He's one of those heavyweights, um, like Trent Williams, that if you decide to get him, 
he'll be a good pickup and he can hold his own. So, you know, I'm glad that they've put out some better heavyweights that can, like, do something for your team if you decide to pick him up. Um, I personally wouldn't pick him up for me because, um, as you guys know, I have obviously two two themed diamond players. Um, John Henderson already has his legend card out, so I would want to pick him up eventually. And um, Darnell Doc is eventually going to get his too. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just not a fan of Geno Atkins, but he's still a good card, obviously. So, you know, and he's only going for 120k. Yeah, 120, which is not that bad. So, you know, that's really good for, for him that, you know, he, he's got a good card out like that. Um, next up, we have Marcus Gilbert. Uh, right tackle. Um, oh, yeah, I forgot to mention this too. But I'll go, I'll look into that in a second. But anyways, uh, 88 strength, 95 awareness, which is absolutely crazy. Uh, 88 pass blocking, 86 pass block power, 88 pass block finesse, 82 run block, 83 run block power, 81 run block footwork. So, um, big body, right tackle, he's standing at 6'6". Um, good strength, good awareness. But as you guys can see... I got Dan Deardorff. Now, as far as this guy is concerned, not a good pickup. Um, average across the boards, run blocking is his worst attribute. Um, running stats are his worst attribute. Um, they're better. They're better right tackles, <clears throat> in my personal opinion. Um, he's a 90, and he could power him up. So if you guys, you know, pick him up at your own discretion, but I personally don't. Not a fan of him be honest with you but anyways we're gonna go ahead and jump into these limited times <clears throat> and see what this Carson Wentz talking about now I heard that this Carson Wentz cannot get escape artists which kind of sucks which might be problematic for me for some people but we'll 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 check it out real quick where is I'm guessing nobody's pulled the Wentz yet no, I'm guessing not. So there's none on the auction block right now. We'll come back to this and maybe there might be one or two of the new players out. Maybe somebody's pulled them. But um, we'll come back to that. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and jump into my team lineup right now. So, as you guys saw, I got Dan Deodorf. I reached level 70, finally. And that's who we pulled. Best right tackle, best right tackle in the game right now. Um, on my team, he has he's a 93 overall, 88 strength, 88 awareness, 93 pass block, 92 pass block power, 94 pass block footwork or finesse, uh, 90 run block, 89 run block power, 88 run block footwork or finesse, whichever whatever the F means. Uh, he's a beast. I've used him a little bit. Uh, he locks people up on the D line for sure. Like he he's really good. And his run blocking it it's good too. So yeah, man, I'm gonna be keeping him around for a while. I got rid of um, Lane Johnson. The reason I did this is because John Runyon, um, he's gonna be getting a legend card eventually. So I'm probably gonna be switching him between those two, and whoever I have starting at their second string counterpart will be at tight end. So if I want to go run heavy or whatever, I can just put them over to that side and go run heavy. So, yeah, we got rid of Lane Johnson for that reason. But anyways, besides that, we also picked up Tyree Kill. We got his, um, got a few coins from the event, played a little bit of seasons when I got bored of running house rules. Got some, got our coins up a little bit more and we ended up picking up Tyree Kill. And, um, what else? Um... We, uh, what else happened? Oh, yeah. So, after leveling up, we went ahead and picked up Deion Sanders for our, um, our 91 and 92 power pass that we got for getting level 70. So, we ended up getting a little bit of training, getting Deion, and, yeah, he, he plays like a beast. I gave him 49er, 49er Kims, since I have more 49er players on my team. And I'm not going to go, obviously, 49ers theme team since I have someone, like I said previously already in this video, that I have someone working on that. But I'm just going to tear up 49ers a little bit more because I'm eventually going to want to get Moss. 
and I'm just gonna give him 49 of cams also. So um, right now we're eight out of 10 for the next one. And the next closest team can we have is the Cardinals and then Jacksonville. So yeah, um, but we'll, we'll see how that works with that. But um, yeah, Dion was a big pickup and um, um, Dan Diodorf was also a good one also and then Tyree Kill. So those are the upgrades we have on our team. <clears throat> um, oh yeah, and we also got Kyle Hughes just for the add a little bit for the 49ers cams also but um but yeah man i like how the team's looking right now um i feel like we made some good upgrades here um we also pulled the um who was it we pulled somebody out of the uh the weekly pack we went ahead and bought the weekly pack and um <clears throat> we pulled i think we just took the coins i forgot who we got but we just ended up taking the coins oh and i got rid of um mel renfro we um, powered him down and then sold him. So, um, got a little bit more coins from that too. So, I'm really happy about that. And <clears throat> Tori holds out a 95 overall too. So, yeah, man. Those are upgrades for the team. Um, that's house rules right now. We're going to go ahead and look and see if the limited times, any of them have dropped yet. Doubt it, but we'll go ahead and see. Uh, but, yeah, I from what I've heard, I don't think he... Um, the limited time player could get um, Carson Wentz. I don't think he can get the uh, Kims. I mean the escape artists. Nah, I still don't see him. Is he not a 92? Like, I don't understand. Nobody's pulled this man yet? No, I guess not. Alright, well. Okay. Well. Yep, sorry guys. I couldn't get you guys footage on the limited time players. Um, But yeah, it'll probably around the weekend when i make the oakland raiders um make an oakland raiders video i'll go ahead and do um do a kind of like a rundown of those two players personally i can already tell you that that avian williamson is gonna be trash carson wentz i'm sure his throwing his throwing stats are good but without escape artists he's gonna be another pocket passer and the reason he doesn't have escape artists is because he doesn't have a power up in the game I don't know why he doesn't have a power up in the game, but he doesn't. So it is what it is. But um, this Carson Wentz, I don't believe he can get escape artists. So just keep that in mind. He has good throwing stats. Uh, if you guys run an Eagles theme team, you know, all the power to you. But yeah, man. Um, but outside of that, uh, those are the upgrades we made to the team. That's house rules. I'm going to go ahead and get into those. Probably going to live stream it. And um, those are limited time players, even though we didn't get a chance to get into it. And we also went over the heavyweights. So, um, just a quick recap for you guys. Again, I am planning on having a 49ers theme team done for, um, for YouTube. So, um, if you guys watch this, let me know in the comment section below if that's something you want to see. If not, if you guys don't let me know, I'm just going to put it out anyways. And you guys could, you know, kind of go over it yourselves if that's something you guys want to keep seeing as a 49ers theme team. Keep in mind... I'm still going to be doing Oakland Raiders theme team. All right, I'm still going to be playing with the Oakland Raiders theme team because I really do like that theme team. It's just the 49ers theme team have also a lot of great stuff on that team also. So I might as well, like I said, I was going to do like a Bayside kind of thing and just have, you know, both both teams and just run those two run those two theme teams. But um, but yeah, it's looking good so far. So like I said, it's probably going to be I'm probably going to put a video on the 49ers theme team up next week at some point so you guys watch out for that and um you guys go ahead like subscribe to the channel your support re really means a lot thank you everybody for who comes through and watches and everything like that um but yeah i'm probably gonna put out an oakland raiders theme team video friday probably f probably friday um it's not gonna be an update it's probably just gonna end up being a gameplay for the weekend league so just stay tuned for that and um house rules uh, okay so yeah we went through everything all right so yeah man stay tuned for that and stay tuned for the 49ers theme team when i drop it peace